Hailing from a family of legends, Harsh Mankhad is in a league of his own. One of the very few representatives from Asia in the international tennis arena, Mankhad was a dominant force when playing for India at the Davis Cup from 2000 to 2005. On a coaching expedition to Sri Lanka to help improve and develop tennis at the grassroots levels in the country, Mankhad shared his story with us. It's a very active sport. So I really took a, a love for it and uh, opportunities sort of uh, uh, arose from there, playing uh, all the junior tournaments, representing India in the juniors, and then moving on from there. So uh, very lucky to be born in this family where I had a lot of opportunities to play sports, to get high quality coaching, and really worked hard over the years to, uh, to develop. Yeah, yeah, it's a big country and, uh, you know, uh, it was always very strong. I mean, growing up, I had a very strong peer group. We had good tournaments. The nice thing is we had tournaments on different surfaces hard court, clay court, grass court. So we grew up with being able to adapt and adapt our games to different surfaces, which I think is very important in tennis. Uh, but very strong competition right through. Uh, and then that really helped me to develop. And I think now too, there's a lot of good players. It's a big country. Uh, and I think we've got work to do in developing the player development system. Uh, and so, you know, players like me who've been uh, in the sport a long time, we've played at the different levels. Uh, it's really incumbent upon us now to come back, to share our knowledge, to get involved and to help uh, as best as we can, the next generation. Yeah, of course, it's a great honor uh, for me. Uh, you know, it was always something I aspired to do from the family that I came. Uh, so I'm very glad that I was able to get to that level, represent uh, India in, in Davis Cup and, and be an ambassador for the country as we travel around the world. So I think tennis provides that opportunity to every individual. So it's really a very big honor and uh, inspires me now to work with the coaches and, and the next generation to inspire them to you know, reach those levels. And hopefully uh, through our efforts, we can have more players rising and playing for their country. Yeah, so, so junior tennis in India. Uh, and then I think uh, we had an academy one year, uh, which was set up, which allowed me to travel uh, internationally at a young age. I think that was a big opportunity. Uh, and then progressing to college tennis was very good in the US for me. A couple of years there helped me to develop my game, get ready to play Davis Cup, get ready to play professional tennis. That was a big break. Uh, and then Davis Cup really helped me to launch my uh, professional career uh, and just going through that process. So a lot of, lot of milestones along the way and you just uh, are very grateful for all the support and people that come at the different stages to help you to continuously improve. Um, so yeah, those were some of the highlights. Yeah, through Davis Cup, I was able to play a couple of world number one singles players. Uh, Leighton Hewitt in Australia was number one in the world at the time. Uh, great opportunity to play against a player of that caliber, see where he was so strong and learn from it. Andy Roddick was another player who was just coming on the scene and I had the opportunity to play him and really face the serve. The speed and the athletic ability at that level is really another notch. Uh, and so those experiences, I think, are critical to play against those players, understand where you are, what are the differences and then go back into training and work on that. And so that's where I think that we can help now uh, the next generation is when they get those opportunities to make sure they're ready for those opportunities and then uh, to also take them to the next level once they've had that, that experience. Yeah, it's something that, you know, is disappointing to be honest. Uh, we, we have so much talent. I really believe in this region. That's one of the uh, driving forces to what I'm doing with Tennis City and, and the collaboration here is to see how we can help uh, the talent and groom them and develop them. Because I see no reason why we shouldn't have more players at the highest level. We've got the facilities, now we've got people with experience. So it's really effort over a period of time uh, that I think we can slowly start to change that. But would love to see more representation uh, in the juniors, in the professional circuit at all levels and definitely at the higher levels of the sport. It's really incumbent upon us now again to make these efforts and to help uh, the junior players rise to that level. Yeah, yeah Tennis City is a player development platform. It's really developed to uh, organize the communication and data around training and performance. The idea is when that's systematic, when the goals are there, the training plans, match results, match evaluations all come into one place, it creates the opportunity for the team to learn from that information and continuously improve their training. So that's really the idea is instead of just showing up and playing, let's put an organized approach together 
Uh, and so that's the effort around Tenacity's platform. Yeah, so, so again, I've been very impressed in the two days that I've been here, so very short time. Uh, you know, I hope to spend more time here to get a better feel for Sri Lankan tennis. But the juniors that I've seen here are uh, very talented. They're willing to work hard, which is a very important aspect. They have a joy for the game. And uh, so in terms of the difference, I think both countries have a lot of potential. Uh, and if we can work together here with uh, Renuk, uh, this is a great start, excellent collaboration. And uh, we can get the partnerships and people behind this. I think both countries can work more closely together. And as a result, uh, player development in the region can, can be lifted up. So hopefully we can see more players coming out of this region and playing at the higher levels. Sure, play the game, you know, enjoy the game. Uh, it's great to have aspirations to be at the top, but this game teaches you a lot about life. You know, uh, where I am, the opportunities I've had to see the world, to meet uh, new people, to really develop myself as a human being, a lot of it is attributed to the game of tennis. It teaches you so much. So enjoy it, definitely play it, it's a lifelong sport. And if you have the talent and, and desire to be good at it, you know, join us and, and uh, just seek out those individuals that are passionate and that can help you to go uh, as far as you can go.